Welcome to Rob on Holiday. Today we're going to take you through a typical day at Centre Parks and it's the Centre Parks at Winfell. And of course the first step has got to be breakfast in the lodge. After breakfast with the ducks it was time for our first walk of the day. Now we're going to get some rain today so we thought while it's not raining we come out for a walk. It's a bit of a bonus. Then we're going to go to Starbucks, then we're going to go in the subtropical swimming paradise and that'll take us through to lunch. Then we're hoping to play some bowls, but again, that may be weather dependent. We go for another walk through the forest and then later on we're going to have a meal at Bella Italia. So hopefully we'll capture all that and you see what a typical day at Centre Parks is like. Now because the subtropical swimming paradise doesn't open until 10 o'clock we decided to do a Starbucks visit before then so hopefully coffee and into the pool. The queue for the subtropical swimming paradise gets quite long at the start of the day so we recommend getting there 10 to 15 minutes before opening time. The subtropical swimming paradise is one of the best things about Santa Parks. This indoor water park includes several indoor swimming pools, water slides and even an outdoor section. I especially love the theming with the trees, bridges and architectural elements dotted throughout the complex. And of course don't worry about getting cold because it's a nice balmy temperature all the time. The water itself is a nice temperature as well. So what's great about going in and swimming about 10 o'clock, you go in, do an hour, an hour and a half swimming, you come out and it's time for lunch. And what, what better place to buy lunch than the park market? After a quick pit stop for lunch, it was time for another walk before our bowl slot. One of the things I like about Centre Parks is the miles of trails that they have that are just outside your lodge door. I mean, some of them are paved with tarmac ready for cars, but others like this go straight through the woods. Free game, ice cream, and Bowls is one of the best value activities at Centre Parks. We bought this a couple of months before we came, and I can't remember, I think it's 10 to 12 pounds. Anyway, let's see how this goes. There are lots of activities available to book at Centre Parks. There are sports like tennis, water activities such as kayaking, and more daredevil activities such as zip wiring. These all come at an additional charge and can be booked on the Centre Parks website before your visit. Before heading back to the lodge for a rest, we stopped by the bird hide and caught a glimpse of a greedy red squirrel. After a refreshing sleep in the comfortable bed, it's nearly tea time, which means it's time to head out to the centre and Bella Italia. It's not every day you get to walk into a cave for your Bella Italia. It's very busy in here tonight. You definitely need to book before you come. So we bought this about two or three months ago. I don't know how long far in advance you can book, but it'll be on the website. But if you can, definitely book in advance. Well, I suppose the future's here. This is the first time I've ever been served by a robotic waiter. We'll see if it takes off. Good 
my review of Bella Italia here at Centre Parks, really good. I mean, the pizzas were so fresh, the toppings were great, lots of toppings. Uh, and it's the first time I've ever been served by a robot waiter. Who knows? It might be like Wi-Fi and mobile order. It might just be commonplace. We might look back on this video in 10 years and say, oh, do you remember the first time we were served by a robot waiter? It happens all the time now. Who knows? So that was our day in Centre Parks. We've really enjoyed it. The weather forecast was atrocious today, but we've only had a few spots of rain. I think we've done a lot. Started off in the subtropical swimming paradise after we've been in Starbucks. Had a good lunch back at the lodge. Enjoyed our game of bowls, then I had a sleep because to be honest, I was wiped out from all the walking that we've done as well. And we finished off with a really nice meal in Bella Italia and been served by robot waiters. And we can do it all again tomorrow. Thanks for watching Rob on Holiday. We hope you enjoyed our video. Subscribe if you enjoy the channel and keep an eye out for more great videos.